I will sum up everything in the previous modules and share some additional techniques with you in this module. With this, I can guarantee you to build up your own empire of affiliate businesses through the process I teach you in this module. You don't send traffic to the vendor's page through your affiliate link just like that. You'll be wasting a great opportunity. Before you send the traffic off to the vendor's page, send it to your page first. If you just send the traffic off to the vendor's page, 96 to 98 percent of the traffic will be wasted. And this is because you'll miss the chance to increase your email list. The worst case is you pay for the traffic, but the vendor sales letter doesn't make the sale, and then you lose money. I'm trying to help you to avoid this worst case scenario while you're building up your affiliate business. Another thing is that the vendor gets to grow the email list, but not you, even though you earn the commission as an affiliate. So the next problem is how to collect the visitor's emails. Use a squeeze page. Direct your readers to your squeeze page first before sending them to the vendor's page, and you can create a win-win situation just like this. The squeeze page is a page to collect the name and email of the visitors. You can collect the emails of your visitors and at the same time earn the commission from the vendor. This is an example of a squeeze page. As you can see from this page, it says enter your best email below and download for free. This is a small tip for you to include a free report in your squeeze page. The format of a squeeze page is simple. Include an attractive headline, a big red arrow, and an opt-in form. The best color choice for the headline will be dark red or black. It must be able to give a teaser of the product they're going to purchase later. I would recommend that you use the font of Tahoma, Arial Black, and Helvetica. The big red arrow in the middle of your headline and opt-in form is to lead them to fill out the form. It's important to catch the attention of the reader, so the big red arrow is pointing to the opt-in form and that will lead their gaze to the opt-in form, which will increase the conversion rate. The opt-in form will always come with an orange or yellow button, just like it's shown in the slide. These two colors have been tested to increase the conversion rate as well. After the opt-in, you can then redirect the traffic to the vendor's page through your affiliate link. Or, you can redirect the traffic to your bonus or review page first before the vendor's page. And this is what I recommend that you do. This way, you can build your credibility and hence keep the subscribers with you. All in all, it's only three simple steps. This way, you can double or triple your mailing list. First, attract and send the traffic to your squeeze page, and then to the vendor's page or your bonus page or review page. It's just that simple. Here is an example of my review page with my bonus offer together in the same page. This is where I'll lead the traffic to after the squeeze page. 